Hi, this episode is about the lessons I've learned from how I met your mother. So, I was watching Friends that time on Netflix and there came a time that I'm almost done watching the series. So, that's when I started looking for other series somewhat similar to Friends. So, that's how I've known how I met your mother. How I Met Your Mother is a series about a father sharing to his children his experiences with his friends and how he met their mother. So there are five main characters of the show. Number one is Lily Aldrin. Second is Marshall Erickson. Third is Barney Stinson. Fourth is Robin Sherbatsky. And fifth is Ted Mosby. So Lily Aldrin is a kindergarten teacher, an amateur painter, and the wife of Marshall Erickson. Marshall Erickson is an environmental lawyer and the best friend of Ted Mosby. Barney Stinson is a businessman who loves expensive suits and a known womanizer. Fourth is Robin Sherbatsky. She is a journalist, an anchor, and the ex-girlfriend of Ted Mosby. And the last one is Ted Mosby. He is an architect and the main character of the show. So here are the lessons that I've learned from each character. First, from Lily Aldrin. When Lily and Marshall was about to get married, Lily called it off to move to San Francisco to follow her dream to be a painter. While some may have seen this as a selfish move, there's something very important that we can learn from this one. Every one of us has this truest and deepest passion for something that we are willing to sacrifice whatever we have right now in order to pursue that passion. And I believe that following our passion is something anyone shouldn't be sorry for. Second is Marshall Erickson. Marshall Erickson wanted to be an environmental lawyer but ended up working in Goliath National Bank. Given the great pay, this is exactly what he needed that time as he and Lily started to get married. Just like Lily, Marshall Erickson also has dreams, but how he set it aside for the sake of his family is truly remarkable. And mind you, there are many Marshall Erickson in this world. And so if you happen to know one, don't forget to give thanks. And third is Barney Stinson. I didn't like Barney at first. I find him really annoying. But sooner he changed and I like the new version. Especially when he started to date Robin, he is way better than his former self. Their relationship is a mere reflection of some relationships we had in the past. The moment that we lose our self in the relationship, it's not healthy anymore. So no matter how much we love a person, some things just don't last a lifetime. The fourth is from Robin Sherbatsky. Robin was really gorgeous. I really thought she's the one for that. But isn't she? Robin is the perfect representation of my life, my roots. She has this strong conviction of not having children. After all, we all have the control of how we should live our lives. Remember that. And the fifth is Ted Mosby. Ted Mosby being the central character of the show is a really selfless guy. He always ensured that his friend's welfare comes first before his own. He may be a hopeless romantic, but thank God the universe has just prepared someone who is exactly like him in every aspect. He's one true match. So if you happen to have given up on love, please don't. Timing is everything. Just don't give up yet. And so that's all for the lessons I have learned from the characters of How I Met Your Mother. So I recommend this show to everyone who is looking for a great watch. This is a really great show. Great values in this series. So if you haven't seen the series yet, you should give it a try. This is one of those series that keep you awake until dawn. And that's all for the lessons I've learned from the characters of How I Met Your Mother. Thank you very much for watching and that this part. Bye-bye.